everyone welcome to my channel today I'm going to do another meditation or intuition piece for you I will be using once again my Windsor and Newton watercolors and then I'll be throwing in some of these uh, metallics and I'm sorry I don't know the names or the colors because this was my mom's and she did not when she was using them did not put the names or color of the colors this I bought but I don't remember the name of the brand or the colors I didn't do it either I didn't even think about it so anyways we're gonna go ahead and get started I am using a number 16 round brush it's Princeton Heritage and I may come in here and use my liner which is a number six with the intuitive pieces meditation pieces whatnot what I recommend that you do is pick out some brushes have them on hand and wherever your intuition leads you is what you're going to grab even color wise we don't I don't have anything pre-planned all right so I do have some water and I know I've shown you a couple different ways, but I'll tell you, to be honest with you, this is the way I enjoy it the most, is to just let it be. I'm not trying to do anything in particular, and just let's see what we come up with. And I can see a lot of things in my pictures, a lot of times even before I start drawing on them. But let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to try to just do simple ones so it doesn't take me a long time to draw on it for you. I'm going to go ahead and stick my brush into the water. Got it wet. And then I am just going to just do some slight coverage. And then I'll take this brush, the thinner brush, and dip it into a color. The first one I'm going towards is an orange color. And just let it be here. Ooh, almost looks like I made a face, doesn't it? not intentional by any means all right then I'm going to just come in here and add some more water just a little bit more as I add in some more colors what will it be you could even close your eyes if you wanted to and just see what where your brush ends up I went ahead and decided to hit the green, which is more, this is more like an olive green. with a heat gun just to dry it a little bit. I'm going to go back in just to do some other little bit darker colors in here.
gonna take my bottle of rubbing alcohol and I'm just gonna do some little spurts. Some of them are gonna be bigger. And one thing I like about this is when you do this, then it kind of separates the paint a little bit and sometimes you get designs that come through that all of a sudden you see something that was made by the rubbing alcohol. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a dry. All right, I always say I'm gonna to try to keep it simple, but I never seem to do that. I am using a Precision B5 Extra Fine Marker. And I'm just gonna do some quick drawing on here. These are around some of the spots that came out with the rubbing alcohol. When you do this, you can go around it as much as you want. If you see something pop out at you, you know, a face or a heart or whatnot, there's meaning behind those. If you wanna just purely use this as put on the meditation music, soft music, whatever, and just keep drawing as you see things, it's very relaxing and meditative.
one of these um, you can go through and just do like some of the bigger things or um, you can go ahead and do that and then come back in and fill in more of the details if you want once you get through that you can come back in and add lines or simple shapes to some of the areas that even if they're colored you know I've done that on on some of them, not just the white spaces that are open so again this that's up to you as to how much detail you want to give your piece and how much time you want to spend so if you're like me and I like to do these while I'm listening to videos or that type of thing I can have as much detail going on here as I want and just keep working on them and filling them in a little bit at a time or as long as it takes till I'm happy with it or I feel um, like I've you know cleared my mind and was able to kind of chill for a little bit so with that in mind I'm just going to leave this as this leave it like this and continue working on it if I want I think I have most of the major white spaces outlined and then there's some larger ones that I'll go back in like I look at this and see this kind of as a heart it's not an exact heart but that's okay that's how I roll don't like things to be precise I just like them to be kind of abstract and free Again, just go in do as little or as much as you want you can make them look like leaves if you want to add more leaves in you can do that add your own designs in as you go that's up to you so you take it where you want it how much you, time you want to spend, how elaborate you want it to be, and just have fun. Relax, clear your mind, and have fun. All right, if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up. New to my channel, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. Sorry, I keep hitting the camera stand. And if you would, make sure that you subscribe, hit the notification bell, as I mentioned, uh, like, and share this video just hit the share button underneath and it'll give you the options of where you can share it and you're good to go all right until the next time please stay safe and healthy and you have a good one